gonna be eating like an icon, a queen, the CEO of Ponytails. Today, I'm gonna be eating like Miss Ariana Grande. Yeah. Why did I just go up like five octaves to say that? Today, I'm gonna be eating like Ariana and I'm so excited because I flipping love her. And let me tell you, my stalking skills is pretty good. So if you guys need like, you know, someone to do some stalking for you, like I'm honestly your girl. It was really hard to actually find her diet. Like she's a little bit more private. She doesn't really tell us what she eats now and then. She might post a Snapchat. So I um, managed to find all of those. Somehow I managed to find out what she actually eats in a day. This might not be every day, but um, this is the foods that she likes to eat. And Ari, I mean, of course she is. She's a, hi mum. Brilliant. Ari's a vegan. I mean, of course she is. I mean, honestly, she is pretty amazing. I would love to be a vegan. I tried it and lasted two months. But she is a strict vegan. She's also uh, gluten-free. She eats gluten-free. I don't know if this is because she's allergic to not. I actually can't remember. She's allergic to my two favorite things. She's allergic to bananas, which by the way, how can you be allergic to bananas? Like never heard that in my life. And tomatoes. Bananas and tomatoes I will not be having today, which is normally in my everyday routine. Um, to be honest, I eat meat as well. So it's actually gonna be really different to my normal diet. So here goes, today I'm eating like Ariana Grande and I'm gonna say that a million times, so I should probably just get into the video. She actually starts her morning with a morning coffee and I don't like coffee. I'm actually starting to like it a little bit more. I mean, I like it basically if there's like a crap ton of like caramel, sugar, toffee, then I like it. She even has like a black coffee, which is like a no-go for me, or she has a soy latte. That's what I was meant to say. So I feel like I might like this, and she gets it from Starbucks, so basically I'm gonna go to Starbucks, get my coffee, and then I'm gonna go and make myself some breakfast, which by the way, like I'm actually starving. I'm so hungry, so I can't wait to get my coffee down me and have my breakfast, so let's go. Today I'm really channeling Ari, to be honest. Um, I mean, her new album's come out anyway, so I'm actually obsessed. But let me know your favorite Ariana Grande song. This is what we're gonna be listening to in the car of the new album. That's what I wanna know. Let me know down below. <laughs> Honestly, that just hurt everyone's ears. Someone stop me. But I've got a coffee that I don't really want. But I'm just very happy that it's in a Christmas cup. And to be honest, it looks really throffy, which I thought it wouldn't. You can't even see that, so that's just crap. But it is, and I'm end gonna end up pouring it all over me, so. Okay, here it goes. Got it everywhere. Oh, it's nice. I think because I only put one shot in it, I think. Whereas if it was a black coffee, it would not be nice. I mean, the more I drink of it, the less I like it. But I'm thinking I could actually drink this with my breakfast. I'm gonna try and actually finish this. And then I also, also managed to find one of Ariana's favorite things to snack on is protein bars. But obviously she's vegan and she's gluten free. So I found a protein bar that's exactly that. And I actually love these. I can't even tell you how much I love the Trek bars. They are insane. So I'm very happy about this. And honestly, I wish I could just have this right now, dip it into my Starbs, but that will not be happening because I'm gonna have breakfast first and actually have a meal. Oh, Ari, I love you for this. This is so flipping good. Honestly, these are my favorite ever. Yes, it is so anyone that knows me knows that I have porridge every single morning. Like, it is honestly my favorite thing. Although normally I have it with like chocolate protein powder, strawberries, it's like, oh, honestly unreal. So Ari, also has porridge, which we love that for her. Though she doesn't have a drop of protein powder, she has it with blueberries, which is something she snacks on quite a lot. So I'll probably be having blueberries throughout the day, which by the way, isn't a very actually like ever eat. And peanut butter, which as we all know, I've honestly become obsessed with. It's my favorite thing ever. So I'm quite excited about having it in porridge. And I'm like halfway down on my coffee. I'm gonna be like bouncing off the walls. No joke, because I don't drink coffee. Your child. <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay, it was so good. Mum, what do you think? Such a half in it. 
Mine was good, but I didn't have whatever you had. No, no, what did you have? Porridge, oh, you butter and blueberries. That's cinnamon. Mm. Which is good. Which is not ironic. You want to eat that with the marker? Can I have cinnamon, of course? I just don't know why, like, go ahead, it was just half in it. You're just sitting there looking at me, like, quite scary, actually. Yeah. Lunch is calling, and I'm gonna make avocado on toast. Which doesn't sound exciting. Basically, I saw Ariana post a Snapchat of her. Actually, I've seen her a few times post Snapchats of her eating avocado toast. I normally it's like around sort of like lunchtime, not dinner. And it's to be honest, who has avocado toast for dinner? No one. So I'm gonna have that for my lunch today. I don't like avocados at all. I really feel like I'm the only person, but I just cannot stand the texture. It's not even the taste, it's the texture. It's a no-go for me. But I'm having it on toast and I managed to find this bread that was actually gluten, dairy, vegan friendly, basically. So I found this toast here, which I will be making my avocados with. Not making avocados with, putting avocado on. That didn't even make any sense. <laughs> As you can tell guys, they're not very ripe. And so this is lunch. If two plus two is four, and five plus five is 10, what the fuck is this? Something I really don't enjoy, but it's actually got a lot of nutritional value. So um, I'm just gonna eat it, basically. I just don't like the texture. Mm. Mind you, it tastes better than normal, and I don't know why. I think I'll actually probably be able to finish it. <laughs> I feel like I managed to eat a fair bit, but it's really just not my fave, so. It's a little update, I've got change. We're gonna go for a walk. So Ariana likes to snack on seaweed thins. So I managed to pick up some seaweed thins. However, this is not that appetizing at all. Like, there surely has to be some sort of nutritional value as to why she eats these, because I can't understand why anyone in their right mind wants to eat seaweed thin. Sounds absolutely vile. You never know. Might end up like and then might taste like crisps. But I'm gonna go for a walk so I'm gonna take these with me. Okay, so they actually do. This literally must be the only reason she eats these because they're high in vitamin B12 and all those other great things. Oh, I just don't think I'm gonna like these but you know, who knows? That's so weird. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh. All I have to say is why? Why? The most vile thing I've ever actually put into my mouth. Absolutely disgusting. I'm actually hungry. I've just eaten, don't even know where I put the packet now, just eaten another protein bar and probably gonna snack on some blueberries and then I'm gonna make my dinner. Cause I'm like really, really, really hungry right now. <laughs> In my dressing gown because it's actually really cold, but I'm gonna make my dinner. I've got tofu sweet potato, which is something that Ari actually eats all the time. And I can't even remember what the last thing. Do you remember what it was? I can't remember. I went out and bought it this morning. I honestly don't even know, but it's something she actually has quite a lot. I really don't like tofu though. So it just like, I don't know why it just like really weirds me out to be honest, but I find enough. So I've got tofu and then she really weirdly, from all the things that I've seen, she actually like fries up the sweet potatoes, which I would do with this with normal potato, but I've never done it with sweet potato for, before. So I just need to fry both of these on a pan. Just waiting for my tofu to cook. However, this is what my dinner's looking like. It's looking quite bland, but I'm actually not complaining because we all know I am the blandest eater ever. So another thing I read is that um, Ariana actually put cinnamon on her sweet potato, which at first I was like, that is so weird. But I can actually imagine it tasting quite good. So I'm gonna give you a little taste test. Mm, but it's nice. Oh my God, cinnamon on sweet potato is the one. I'll tell you what, anything is better than seaweed. But like this is actually really good. I actually quite like sweet potato fried like this too. I also put cinnamon all over, like this cinnamon sort of like sauce over my tofu because I knew that I wasn't gonna like it. And I know she loves cinnamon. So I thought, you know, it's gonna be on the sweet potato. So I put it on my tofu too. <laughs> Long story short, the amazing vlogger that I am didn't end this video. I'm gonna blame it on the seaweed because pretty much it should be illegal. It was absolutely disgusting. From the moment I ate it, I felt physically sick. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you wanna see any more worry like celebs for a day. Anyways, shall see you all soon. Okay, I'm gonna end it now. Bye.